lunchtime of champions. Got myself a nice chunky soup here. Pop top. Don't need a can opener, although I keep a can opener with me. There was another swamper. Uh, shit, he was a beefcake swamper. He'd always bring ravioli cans, and he'd leave them up here on the dash, and you know, the truck's running all morning, and then he'd have a nice warm can of food, and wouldn't have to heat it, just crack it open and eat it. It was awesome. So, yo. Hanging out here on lunchtime. Richmond Compost. Drivers need a break too, you know. They might not be doing physical, but, you know, moving around that uh, wheel all day is tough. So, they're entitled to a break, and, you know, if you're an hourly one, you might get one. If you're a contract one, then you can stop and eat on the way or something and skip your own break and then end up working later anyway. <sighs> At least I'm getting breaks. So this is the Smith ride I was on this morning. And I'm in an international one here. One with the crappy blue smoke and the handles that stop the truck entirely. 0206, I think they call it. So, there's our cool map for the day wherever the hell we were going. That's up to the driver. Not my jurisdiction, you know. Bring me to the can and I'll throw it in. Ah, oh, well, I'll enjoy being a garbage man uh, for as long as I can. It's too bad it'll be driver only. Uh, I don't think that's right. I don't know, I guess if they could do like driver only road crews for construction or weird things like that, if. I don't know. Go get my license sometime. But, I still gotta make some good videos for the glory times of people doing four cans at once and, you know, double can after double can and all kinds of crazy things. Uh, the glory of garbage. Not everybody understands it, but if you've thrown it, you'll understand it. Like, we're in a big trucking area out here. Uh, I'm gonna have my uh, chunky soup here, so game off. <laughs>